Hello everyone, welcome back to Magic. This video is about use of differentiation in our real life. So differentiation is a topic under calculus. So differentiation is basically about rate of changes. So not only it, it, it used in mathematics, it used in all subjects like physics, chemistry, biology, economics, environmental science and etc. In physics, it is used to find rate of change of moving objects, like to find instantaneous velocity of moving car, rockets, jets and etc. In chemistry, it is used to find at what rate the concentration of chemical reaction changes. And in biology, it is used to find at what rate the crops grows in a field to find birth rate, death rate and in economics, it is used to find marginal cost price means in a factory, if a product increases, then at what rate the cost increases that can be find by using differentiation. So let's get into some practical examples. Let's suppose the motion of the rocket is given by the function S is equal to S of T is equal to 400 t square minus 500 t plus 175 where t is the time taken and s of t is the distance traveled by the rocket. So we have to find out what is the speed means instantaneous speed of the rocket at 10 seconds. So let's see. So differentiate both sides with respect to t which is equal to 400 as it is and differentiate with respect to t square with respect to t is 2 times t minus 5 as it is free from differentiation. Differentiate of t with respect to t is 1 plus differentiate of function function is 0. Now, different change in distance with respect to time is called as a speed. So, this is speed is equal to 400 times 2 is 800 times t minus 500 times 1 is 500. So, we have to find uh, what is the velocity uh, speed of the rocket. Uh, when time is 10 seconds, that is called an instantaneous speed. So at t equal to 10 seconds, so speed of speed at 10 t equal to 10 is equal to 800 times 10 minus 500. Now 8000 minus 500 is 7500. Let's suppose distance in meter and time in second. So this is in meter per second. So if you want to convert into kilometer, so divide 1000, so 7.5 7 .5 kilometer per second. So the speed of the rocket uh, at 10 seconds, so that is a 7.5 So let's have a look for second. another problem. So air is being blown into the football at the rate of 112 cc per second, that is a cubic centimeter per second. We have to find at what rate the radius of the ball changes. Eh? when the radius of the ball is 14 centimeter that is fixed so let's see so the ball is in the shape of sphere the volume of the sphere is volume of the sphere is 4 by 3 pi r cube where r is the radius now we have to find a change of radius with respect to time so now differentiate so differentiation of v volume with respect to time is equal to so this is a numerical value so free from differentiation pi and differentiation of r cube with respect to time is 3 r square and now differentiation of r with respect to t is dr by dt that we have to find so the volume is changes 112 cc per second now 4 by 3 pi constant value is 22 by 7 into 3 the radius of the ball is fixed that is a 14 square into 14 now dr by dt that we have to find now 7 to the 14 3 3 gets cancelled now 112 now 4 times 22 times 2 times 14 is a 2 4 6 4 and derivative of r with respect to time we have to find dr by dt now divide both sides by 2 4 6 4 2 4 6 4 now this is get cancelled now 112 divided by 2 4 6 4 is a 0.045 approximately this is in the centimeter per second this is the change of radius with respect to time 
So let's have another example in economics. So let's suppose the company produces X units of products for the total cost C of X is given by the function C of X is equal to 3X square plus 36X plus 15. So this represents X is the number of units and C of X is the cost price. Then we have to find what is the marginal cost when company produces 10 units of products. So marginal cost means increment or decrement in the cost when company products increases by one unit. We know in our real life if a company or a factory increases its products or in a quantity then the cost the profit on the cost going to increase. So mathematically it says as a change of cost price with respect to quantities. So let's see how to calculate that. So now differentiate with respect to x. x is nothing but quantities. So differentiate of c with respect to x is equal to 3 as it is free from differentiation. Differentiation of x square with respect to x is 2 times x plus 36 as it is. Differentiate of x with respect to x is 1 plus differentiation of constant function is 0. Now differentiation of cost price with respect to quantity is equal to 3 times 2 is 6x plus 30 times 36 times 1 is 36. Now we have to find the marginal cost when the company produces x units. So when x is equal to 10 units of products, any products. So now substitute when company produces x equal to 10 which is equal to 6 times 10 plus 36 which is equal to 96 rupees means if a company increases 10 units then the margin that is profit on cost going to increase 96 for each unit so these are the three main examples of a differentiation so i hope you like this video and for more videos subscribe and press the bell icon so that you can get the notification